Hey guys, today we're on the set of The Show Show, a new show about the show, and this is a behind the scenes look live at this, us, and the game. game. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. All right, we're going to do some stuff. So, we got these cool little things in our ears called IFBs. So, they're going to give us the questions. We're going to answer as much as we can, as soon as we can while we're here. We're also going to show you some stuff. Uh, so, I've been seeing, as we've been announcing stuff, people was like, hey, can you make creative player guys look really good? So, you're seeing a creative player guy I just made. He looks pretty good. Another question we got a lot was, do the real players, you know, those side-by-side -side screens that we release, does everybody look that good? Oh, my gosh. Let's take a look. <laughs> Somebody specifically asked, hey, how does Andrew McCutcheon look? Um, he looks like Andrew. He looks I mean, like Andrew McCutcheon. Look at that. It's he looks like Andrew McCutcheon. Let's take a look at another player. Who are we going to go to? Who are we going to go to? Who are we going to go uh, to? Syndergaard? Ah, yeah, so, oh, yeah, Leslie, Syndergaard. Leslie. Yeah. Uh, Ethan would like to know if we've added anything to Instant Replay. Instant Replay remains the same for MLB The Show 17. It's the same thing as last year. We had all those new animations, the cat and mouse gameplay, okay. the all-new catch and throw engine, or we could have did more replays. Which, which, which one do you think was a better idea? The gameplay stuff? Gameplay. Gameplay, gameplay. okay. Yeah. Yeah, Noah looks exactly like Noah Syndergaard, Noah which is awesome. Good. He looks we'll look really at, we'll look at good. one more guy. Right. Who are we going to look at? One more guy. These ratings are not final. Ratings are not final. Uh, Robert would like to know if there's anything new in Road to the Show. Yes. It's this thing called Pave Your Path, which we're going to talk about in a few weeks. Road to the Show is all about this new non-linear experience where your decisions matter. Okay, cool. So I know y'all been wanting to see more gameplay. We're going to show you more gameplay. And let's look, we'll go into a new stadium. Let's go into the Mets stadium. Who are they going to play against? Game is not done, by the way. All right, give us another question. Charles wants to know what is in the Hall of Fame edition. Oh, a lot. Um, let's see if I can remember all this. So the Hall of Fame edition is it's exclusive to GameStop. Um, there's a certain limited number of those. They will sell out. You get this. New era, Griffey 5950 hat. Show them the logo. Show them the logo. Look at that. That's yeah. the Swingman logo. That's not the MLB logo. So you get this hat. You get the uh, steel book, the MVP case, which is okay. modeled after King Griffey Jr.'s jersey. Pretty cool. Uh, you get a few special car packs. You get some stubs, and those will sell out probably in the next few weeks. The Hall of Fame edition is going to sell out. For more information, you can go to the show.com where we have a breakdown of all of the different SKUs available this year. Okay, cool. Uh, Trevor would like to know if the Mariners have the light blue jersey. Yes, they do, Trevor. There you go, Trevor. Uh, Trip would like to know when it comes out. Very important question. Very Great important question, question right there, Ramon. March 28th, exclusively on PlayStation 4. And, and you can pre-order it today at your local retail. That's right. <laughs> We're laughing because, We're laughing because this people question are talking in our ear. It's very funny stuff. Robert had a very good question about Diamond Dynasty, mm -hmm. uh, talking about uh, deck building. Can you kind of explain that a little bit? Yes. So, Diamond Dynasty, lots of changes this year. This was actually Diamond Dynasty week. We had a GameStop Monday that went out. You guys should go check that out. We also had a PlayStation blog and video go out. Mm -hmm. And we had a Diamond Dynasty live stream back at home at studio, San Diego Studios. On Twitch, it's archived. You should be able to find our Twitch link somewhere. It's around here. We'll put it somewhere. up. Somewhere. Lance Leahy, Stephen Tips, Haas, and Nick Livingston did that live stream. Lots of good info. So if you want to know about Diamond Dynasty, please go check out that stream and all the video content we released today, this week. What's next? Alex would like to know if there's a story mode this year. Ramon? It is your story. It's called Pave Your Path. We'll talk more about it in the next few weeks, which is in road to the show. Uh, Jacob would like to know if you can play old school Griffey games. Yes, you can. You can. We got Perfect. this new mode called Retro Mode. 
Retro mode's really cool. You know what's cool about retro mode? You can play lots of games really fast. One button mode. X does everything. Pitch with X, hit with X, feel with X. Super simple mode. That's exactly what it was back in the day. Exactly what it was back in the day. That's perfect. We're getting going old every, school. Yeah, everything you want is in this game. It's perfect. Josh says this is the best baseball game out there. Not really a question, Josh, but we'll take it. We Thank appreciate you. that, Josh. We try really hard every year. What else do we a really have? Good baseball game. Rick wants to know if you had to pick a favorite game improvement this year, what would it be? Oh, I have to choose one. Um, everything. But if you're going to make me choose one. I, I, I think gameplay. Um, we really took the time this year to look at all of the things that kind of maybe have been lacking. Mm -hmm. Clean those things up with the, catch, the new uh, catch and throw engine, the cat and mouse gameplay, and these hit types with all this new ball physics. But there's so much new in the game. I think mine is probably pave your path. Can't talk about it too much, but it, I'm sold. Like, we talked about it a lot on this it caps was this so week. It so much fun. Will you be able to carry your road to the show over from 2016? Yes, you can with that feature called Year to Year Saves. All okay. you need to do is just keep that save file, and then you'll pick up right where you left off. A cool thing um, people always ask, if you're using uh, Year to Year Saves and Road to Show franchise, like Noah Syndergaard, for instance, he didn't have a head scan last year. Uh, oh, and I just gave up a bomb. There you uh, go. We don't keep the art data uh, in Year to Year Saves, so Noah Syndergaard is like, he's a number, he has a player ID. So since we don't keep the art files, you get the new Noah Syndergaard that we just showed you and his face scan and all that stuff. And that's for all real MLB players that we created. So you don't have to worry about that. Don't it's, have to worry about it. It's that. all going to get updated. It's perfect. Everything's going to get updated. Right. Any more questions? Francis would like to know if there are sabermetric stats. Yes, they are. You can see them in the player card. Joel would like to know if there's more camera modes besides retro mode. So I'm assuming you're talking about when you're playing the game. No, retro mode is the only new camera view, which okay. you can use in the regular game. But there are new camera views for presentations in the game. Perfect. So a lot of you are asking about the commentary and what's new with that, Ramon. So we have two new people joining the booth. Got some new friends joining Matt Vasgersian, which we will talk about in a few Weeks, really excited about those guys. You think I'm going to know who they are? Uh, They're going to know who they are? Yeah, they might. They might. They might have guessed it by now. They Maybe might. they haven't. <laughs> and I'm throwing pitches down the middle on purpose so y'all can see balls put in play and ball physics and all that stuff. Right. Right, right. Of course, that's yep. why you're doing it. And that. that's why I'm giving them home runs. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what else do we have? Um, a lot of you are asking about uh, stadiums. You know, are there any new uh, stadiums this year that yes, you guys have put into the game? Yes, there are four new classic stadiums. Let's see if I can remember them after this long week. Old Yankee Stadium. Oh, nice. The Metrodome, is that correct? Old Twin Stadium. Uh, Shea Stadium and... Wait, that's, that's three, not that's four. Three, right? that's, that's three, that's three, not okay. four. So I'm failing at life right now. Well, maybe you should just play the game and find out what the fourth is. Oh, so there you go. Oh, Miami. Or that, or Ramon can just tell you. What other questions do we have? Sean would like to know, in preparation for the game, what he should be doing in 2016, the show, mm -hmm. to get ready for 17. Oh, getting that year to your safe already. You should, or pre-order yeah. MLB to show 17. Okay. I, what I should be doing is not swinging at yeah. terrible pitches, which is what I'm doing. Pre-order right the game or buy it on March 28th. What else? Uh, can you import your Diamond Dynasty logo from 16 to 17? Not this year. We actually we actually prototyped that feature during pre-production. Uh, we just didn't have enough time to get it in. So maybe that's something you'll see uh, next year. Next question. A lot of you would like to know if there's trading cards in Diamond Dynasty. Oh, no, that would be a massive, uh, no, no trading cards. <laughs> you got to earn the cards. Got to earn them. Got to earn them. And there's tons of ways to earn cards. You don't have to buy card packs. Tons of ways. You got programs and missions, and you get cards for just playing the game. Courtney would like to know if presentation packages have been improved. Yes, they have. We have hundreds of new presentations in the game and an all-new presentation package, which y'all found out about today, 
because it got leaked. There you go. Sometimes leaks occur. Sometimes leaks occur. It's okay. But it's, but it's okay. Builds up the hype. Builds up the hype. Um, again, a lot of you are wanting to know about the graphics of the game. So what, what were the biggest graphic uh, changes this year? Right. So, you know, every year um, when we have our postmortems on the game, uh, we look at basically where we were last year. So we finally got, like, the stadiums and our atmosphere looking really, really good. And so what you guys were saying were the exact same things we were saying internally in the studio was that the players, the way they look, their bodies, and their faces needed to basically come up a little bit. Everything else looked good. So we focused, pretty much put all our resources into the faces. That's why we showed you those comparison shots um, earlier on in the week. We have, like, the, all the lighting's new on the faces. Our depth of skin tone is so much better. We completely redid the eyeballs. Like Patrick and John Ramsey, they ripped out the eyes. Our shapes were a little off. So everything with the eyes is completely redone. We think you should have noticed that in those side-by-sides. Also, we have body scaling sliders, um, I, which I think maybe in the GameStop or IGN video, you might have noticed. So real MLB players, uh, we, edit, we hand edit those guys. Like we give them bigger arms right. or a longer torso or whatnot. All of the created player and edit player, you get to edit those guys out. Yeah, and I can tell you that it took me maybe two to three hours. I was still creating my character because there's so much to do in it. It's like an RPG? New. It is, very much like an RPG. Hannah saw our Instagram story and would like to know what Ken Griffey smells like. Do you want me to go? Roses. He smells like roses. Victory roses. And it's very, very sweet, man. Ball. All right. As we bought. As we have the, as There's we no bought, way that could have happened uh, it's any better. So why Ramon is excited is because we, uh, you guys would like to know, have we done anything to uh, control bunt Yes, controls. yes, yes, yes. So we tried to show it in the live stream. Didn't go as good as uh, we wanted to. But the cool thing was, uh, one, we noticed that we were doing fastballs down the middle on the gameplay live stream, which that makes bunting a hell of a lot easier. But we all oh, yeah. also noticed yeah. a few things still weren't working right. So we went back to the drawing table again. We reworked bunting again. And you'll see some of that on the Little Things live stream this Thursday. So, yes, bunting will be a lot yeah. Harder this year, I promise. Yeah, so not saying no, it's no going to be that. perfect. Not saying it's going to be perfect, but it's going to be a lot better yes. this year. Somebody recognized me. That's great. It's always good to get recognized. Uh, is there anything new in the sounds yes, of the show that comes from Justin? New, lots of new in sounds of the show. Well, we have new sounds of the show slots, and we have a few sounds of the show new features. Those features will reveal next week. Okay. In the GameStop Monday. I think the GameStop Monday next week is a little thing. I don't think we reveal that. So, yes. So, tune in next week for the little things like that. Chris would like to know if we're getting a more personalized story and road to the show. Yes, you are. It's called Pave Your Path. Nonlinear experience. Nick Livingston and his brother, who's working on the game, helping us out this year. We're driving him into the ground. We're working his brother so hard. So you'll find out a lot more about Road to the Show in the coming weeks. All right, getting a ton of questions now about hair, uh, specifically hairstyle. So uh, is that something that's been updated? Oh, hell yeah, it's been updated. We're live. <laughs> <laughs> well, how many hairstyles are there? Well, we started off from scratch. For hairstyles, we took out all the old hairstyles. Okay. I think we have a little bit over 20. It might be 20. Uh, we have a mix of new school styles, styles that you'll see on current players, and we also have some throwback styles too, like that Raleigh Fingers mustache. We got ah. a mullet. We got a Jerry Curl, y'all. And my favorite, so we got that well. Oscar Gamble Afro. Yes, sir. Tons of new stuff in Creative Player. Pretty much a complete revamp of Creative Player. Awesome. No, let's not ask that question on live TV. See, and I didn't do it. Because <laughs> what was told into my ear was uh, a secret. Yep, secret. It's a secret. We have a few of those left. We're going to let you know the secrets later on, though. But not today. We'll give you a few. Next question. Wes would like to know if Battle Royale tiers will be the same this season. I cannot 1,000% remember correctly, but I do know where you can find the answer. Hmm. You can find it in the Diamond Dynasty live stream that went live yesterday. It is archived 
on our Twitch channel. Okay, go, go there find, find the answer. All right, a uh, bunch of people asking about the weather. Will there be 2016 weather in this, or has it been updated? I don't, I don't understand that question completely. Well, what's the weather like in, in 2017? Um, it's nice outside right now. Where we are, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's beautiful. I don't know where you are. It, it'll vary. It tends to all over the globe. Next question. A lot of people, you know, it's like, why, why should I pre-order? Why wouldn't you pre-order Yeah, why wouldn't game? you pre-order the game? There's lots of different versions you can pre-order. I also just remembered the build that we're playing on, because I've been on the road for like two weeks. This doesn't have any of the bunting changes in it. <laughs> just want to throw that out there. Michael would like to know if there's going to be more live events in the show this year. Yes, there will. You know what else is live? Hmm. That Twitch stream yesterday was live. It is archived on our Twitch channel. What we also on? released yeah. two Diamond Dynasty videos, a GameStop Monday and a PlayStation blog. It has all the info you could ever want about Diamond Dynasty. Lance Leahy, Stephen Haas worked their butts off on DD this year. Go check out those pieces of content for more info. <coughs> uh, what have you guys done to speed up throwing animations? We have done quite question. a bit. That is the new catch and throw engine, and that is also Humanity AI. Our um, fielders now recognize who's at bat, they recognize the situation. If Bill, Billy Hamilton's at bat, the shortstop and the second base, but they know they can't, they can't double tap to throw that ball over there because Billy Hamilton's going to be safe. Yeah. So I know what the question is, like why don't you just make everybody throw the ball really fast all the time? Thing is, it's not realistic, and if the game played like that, you notice it, and the first thing you go is that's not realistic. Because in real life, baseball is a long season, 162 games. Miguel Cabrera can't be running a 4-3-40 down the first base all the time. So if the guy knows he's going to be out, he's going to throttle it down. And that allows us to play way more animation so you see more variety. And it helps out with realism. OK, let's get a few more questions. Uh, Lori would like to know, what updates have we made to online matches? We changed the uh, online matchup rating. I don't remember exactly what we did, but we did change it. OK, next question. Um, a lot of people asking about uniform changes. Uh, do we, we have any this We tried to year? make sure that all of the uniforms that are in the style guide are now in the game. That was what we focused on this year. So uniforms. every alternate jersey? Pretty much okay. any team that has a bunch of alternate jerseys, we tried to make sure at least all of the alternate jerseys that are in the style guide are in the game. And some teams have more, like Arizona Diamondbacks, they have like 11 San Diego Padres has, I think they might have 11. Also, the Padres camo color is fixed. We tuned that cal camo color after that came out, so that'll look good. All right, next question. Alex says it looks exactly, exactly like the show 16. Alex, you haven't been paying attention this week. Did you see those side by side? Yeah. Uh, and again, I saw them. And again, not a question. Not a question. Uh, what flashback? Ooh, we have, we have tons Thomas of new flashbacks. Like to know that. Yeah. The cool thing is we can create any flashback we want. Steven will be creating cards from today until the end of the season. We actually have revealed a lot of new flashbacks. You want to see them, go check out all the Diamond Dynasty content we released this week. Okay. We're getting a ton of questions about rainouts and postponements. Uh, are those going to happen in nope, 17? Nope, they're not going to happen. Um, we actually, I don't even know if we brought it up during pre-production. It's a lot of work to do that and we focused on other things like gameplay and Diamond Dynasty and Road to Show and Franchise and all those new presentation animations and all those new gameplay animations. Okay. If we ever get the time and we can figure out a cool game thingy way to do it, we'll introduce it, but not this year. Hey, so if you're an Indians fan, a Cubs fan, don't have to worry about that right now. Well, if you're a Cubs fan, you didn't really care because you, yeah, you won. Indians fan, you blew a 3-1 lead. Anyways, next question. Jeffrey says the game looks great. Again, not a question, but Thanks, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. Thank you. Appreciate that. Appreciate it. All right, let's get a few more in there before we close this down. What do we got? Ben wants to know, can we get online couch co-op? Not an MLB show 17, but if anything is possible in the future. There you go. Very, very important question coming in. Probably the most important question of this live event. 
can you play with Ken Griffey? Yes, you can. You can also play with his dad, Ken Griffey Jr. Senior. What? They're both in the game, and Ken Griffey Jr. is in the game three or four times. I think we've revealed two of his cards. We've actually yes. revealed his rookie card, which is what you get for pre-ordering the game at any of your local retailers. Okay, let's get one more question in. What do we got? Uh, can you add historic players, is, is one asking. Can you add more? Oh, we have. Yeah. We have added 30 new legends to the game. We've revealed some of them on all that time <laughs> content that we Again, released. go back Let's and see. check it out. Go yeah. back and check out that content. But I, yes, we have 30 new legends. And I lied to you. We're going to have two more questions. So two more get, questions. Let's get that next one. And as we ask for a next question. And as we ask for the next question, we don't have must, a next question. It must be a very important one. Very important one. Exactly. No, we cannot. Nope. Nope. Already been nope. over this. Nope. We answered this already. We can't can't reveal that just yet. All right. So the other question is is when can I get this game? When can I pre-order? Just remind the folks again, Ramon, when they can do that. MLB The Show 17 <laughs> is exclusively available for the PlayStation 4 console. On March 28th, pre-order now. Raindrops, drop tops. There you go. Thank you guys for all the questions. There's a bunch of new and exciting stuff in the show 17. Check out our Twitch streams coming up, and don't forget to pre-order at theshow.com. Remember to go check out those streams that Ramon was talking about. I'm Tyler. Ramon, we'll see you guys pretty soon. Thanks, guys, Thank for your you questions. Thank you for your questions. We out. Let's go home.